Hello everyone, my name is Michael and welcome to Sovereign Thinking. Have you ever said something in anger that you regretted? If you answered yes to the question, I don't want you to think too hard about it because saying things in anger is a normal experience that nearly everyone has done at least once in their lives. Trust me on that. <laughs> but today's story is all about learning how your anger can affect other people. It is a fictional story, but I felt that the message was heartfelt and worthy of telling even if you've heard this story before. So let's dive into it. There was once a young boy who had a very bad temper. He would get into fights at his elementary school, and he didn't have many friends. His father got many calls from the school counselor explaining that his son had an anger issue and that he needed to get it under control over the summer holidays. Otherwise, the boy wouldn't be allowed to return back to school. The father decided to hand his boy a bag of nails and said that every time the boy lost his temper over the summer, that he had to hammer a nail into the fence. On the first week, the boy had hammered 55 nails into that fence, and the boy gradually began to control his temper over the next few weeks during summer, and the number of nails he was hammering into the fence slowly decreased. He discovered that it was easier to control his temper than to hammer those nails into the fence, which is what his father had intended. Finally, the day came when the boy didn't lose his temper at all. He told his father the news, and the father suggested that the boy should now pull out a nail for every day that he kept his temper under control. The days passed, and the young boy was finally able to tell his father that all the nails were gone just in time for school to resume. The father took his son by the hand and led him to the fence. Thank you for listening to this story. By recognizing in yourself that you are angry in a moment, perhaps you will discover that you have the power within yourself to take control over your emotions and to cause less pain by monitoring your actions. Please remember to take what vibes with you and leave what doesn't. And if you would like to hear more stories like this one, then feel free to like and subscribe to the Sovereign Thinking YouTube channel. Thank you again, and I hope you have yourself a wonderful day.